If you're a procrastinator like me, you've undoubtedly had situations where you needed to change or add something to your program, but you just didn't feel like doing it at the time. So like many of us, you put in a to-do comment, which you'll search for later on when you're feeling more motivated to complete the task. Conveniently, MPLAB X helps procrastinators like us through the tasks list. The editor is set up to detect special tags or patterns at the beginning of a comment that will indicate that the comment should be added to the task list. And as you can see in my code here, I've got a couple comments there on line 42 and 43 that start off with the word to do. Now to view all the tags that are available, you just go up to the tools menu and select options. And again, if you're on a Mac, it's MPLAB and preferences. You go to the miscellaneous category and then down to the tasks tab. And as you can see here, we've got six uh, to-do patterns that are already defined, uh, starting with at to-do and then the all caps to-do, which I used in my code, and a few others. And from here, you can very easily add your own by clicking on the add button, or you can edit or remove any of the existing ones to suit your needs. So let's see these in action now. So first we need to open up the tasks window. And I do that by going to the window menu and selecting tasks. And by default, it should open up down near the bottom, uh, right by the output tab. Now at first, you're not gonna see anything in the tasks window, especially if you just added the comments recently. You need to first save the project, which forces the ID to scan through all your code, where it'll then pick up all of the tasks that are listed. And as you can see, there are three comments that I had in my program here that uh, all start off with to do. And the nice thing is I could, for example, be in a completely different file doing something else entirely. And then later on when I feel motivated to come back and perform one of these tasks, I can just come down to the tasks window, double click on an item, and the IDE will take me right to that line and put the cursor there to let me know uh, which line it is that, uh, that requires the task to be completed. So whether you want to use it for personal reminders or to pass notes on to fellow team members, the tasks list provides a convenient way to take notes on all those things you need to do to finish your program. For MPLAB XTV, I'm Rob Ostapia.